I love helping people. I love helping my patients. I love helping my partners. I like helping people learn and grow. I like solving problems. I would describe Dr. Wooden as humble, compassionate, kind. I clearly see her using her gifts, her abilities, and her passion to take care of Peace Health's greatest assets, that is our providers and caregivers. She has done an exceptionally good job of being the voice of the clinicians. I was watching my partners burn out around me and it was really painful to not have things to offer them. The practice experience program came about because as we were looking at data and uh, collecting information about what would improve the clinicians' work lives. It's estimated that about 50% of our clinicians are experiencing burnout or symptoms of burnout at any given time. The fallout from that includes more malpractice claims, poor patient care, poor patient experience, and even things like physician suicide, substance abuse, divorce. She said, we need to think of well-being as providing the ongoing support, coaching, and education necessary for our providers to thrive. Having that additional resource for counseling, coaching, and practice efficiency, I think has just been incredibly beneficial to our clinicians. Bringing clinicians together and giving them a group setting where everybody was working on trying to improve their experience of the practice of medicine had a very profound impact on their well being. We actually had a clinician who had written her letter of resignation and submitted it. And when she got under about 60 days, to, to her end date. She went to her leadership and rescinded her letter of resignation. She cited the PEP program as the primary reason. She stated that she felt like an organization that would support her in this way to improve her practice was worth sticking with and she wanted to continue working for Peace Health. This work has taken it so far in the right direction and built a path for us to continue to go down to make the improvements that we want to make. She is willing to, you know, step up and, you know, challenge, challenge us, challenge our organization to be better and do better so that we can thrive. I think patients deserve to be cared for by clinicians and caregivers who are well.